Hey y'all, welcome in or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am bringing you a self-care haul specifically for bath time for people with eczema or sensitive skin. So let's get right into it. Cue the intro. Figured I will walk you through a bath time that I recently had instead of just sitting down and showing you different things. But let's go ahead and start with this tray from Amazon. It is adjustable and it has two soap trays or trays on the side. I don't know, you can use anything for it. And then it also has a wine holder as well as a cup holder, your phone holder, and then that black piece folds out so you can prop your book up or your phone if you so choose, whatever you want it to prop up there. After reviewing this footage, I realized that I treated these like the star of the show. There's so much footage of them. But these are just candles and they're circular because it just adds to the whole luxe feel of the bath. Light you a candle. These are unscented, so it doesn't bother you too much. All right, so I love bubbles, but obviously there's a lot of bubble baths out there that we cannot use with our sensitive skin. But this one did not entertain my skin at all. It is from the Honest Company. They have this bubble bath line or whatever it is. But it added uh, quite a few bubbles. As you can see, I went in. I literally used half of this bottle. But I was expecting it to suds up like a decent or a regular um, bubble bath. However, it does not do that because it doesn't have all those harsh ingredients, which is good. So this was definitely a good one. This one is so good. It Obviously, you know that with eczema, you cannot use a lot of different scents. However, this one is scented with essential oils, which does not bother my eczema. So as you can see, I went in with this one as well. It is so good. This one has the orange essential oil in there and it just kind of opened up everything. It took the bath to the next level. It smelled really well in there. And then I'm following up with this Dr. Teal's unscented Epsom salt just to kind of relax you and obviously de-stress your muscles. So add that to your bath. It's an enhancement for sure. Here is a close-up of that detox soap that I use. It is so good. I had to show you so you can go get you some. Go get you some, for sure. Back to the bath salts. Here's another one that is definitely a calming one. I will zoom into the title in a second because I don't know the title. But this one has oatmeal and lavender in it and it's just I definitely was calm after this bath, so I don't know if this is credited to this or what, but it definitely felt like I elevated my space, okay? Here is a good look at how much bubbles Bell's Chew Bubble Baths made, and as you can see, this is a decent bubble bath. You may or may not know that oatmeal calms your eczema prone skin to the teeth. So I follow up with these packets of oatmeal and it's so good. And of course, fill that tray up with a nice book, a sponge or two so you can wash yourself, <laughs> um, your wine or your tea in my case, and go ahead and relax. Take it off. Pray while you're in here. Give things to God that you haven't been talking to him about. Just definitely enjoy yourself and treat yourself well and have a good relationship with yourself. So I hope that this video inspired you to live life abundantly through pursuit of the life that God has for you through Christ Jesus. I hope that you will go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Stick around so we can be friends, our eczema buddies, you know. Um, but as always, let's go out and live life abundantly. Peace out. You got that something, baby, that I can go with.